Welcome back. The summer sales are really heating up. This summer we are putting more focus primarily on eShop deals. The devs have lost their minds. If there are games you've been waiting on playing, now's the time to act if you can. First up is Cuphead. The DLC is not on sale, but you can get it for seven bucks. Three and a half gigabytes, an action, arcade, platformer, shooter kind of game. One of two players. Fair warning though, this game is hard. It may end up being one of the hardest games you have ever played. No, I'm not kidding either. Inspired by cartoons from the 1930s, the gameplay is. Hard to believe we're coming up on a hundred years of that decade. It's a run and gun style of game with weapon power-ups and super moves. Also just want to tell you that these games all go off of their sale on June 6th. So you have about a week to decide on what you want to get and don't want to get. If you like content like this, we'll be doing a lot more of this. So give a like and subscribe as it really helps out the channel. All right, let's get to the video. Goodbye. Eastward. One player, 1.7 gigabytes. Adventure slash action slash RPG kind of game. You play as John and you play as Sam who escape tyranny to join Eastward. You'll solve puzzles, you'll fight enemies, and you'll uncover many other things about this world that you are living in. I just bought this during the sale, actually, so I'm kind of new at playing this game, but I already love it. The story is great so far, and the story does mean a lot to me in games. I highly recommend this one, even though I just started playing it. Scott Pilgrim vs. The World 1.1 gigabytes action slash fighting game yeah it's a beat em up and some say it is one of the best beat em ups that has ever been made I do not think it is exactly the best but one of yeah I can definitely entertain the notion regardless for five dollars this is pretty much a must buy one to four players, two to four players online. Super Mario Maker 2, Nintendo's own. One to four players, two to four players online. Three gigabytes which is outstanding considering the amount of constant content you are getting from this game. Absolutely one of my favorite games on the Switch, maybe ever, I think it is up there. I'm a huge old school Mario kind of guy, but you don't have to be, and you also don't really have to be all that into making your own courses as well. You can totally just play other people's courses and the story mode if that's what you'd rather do. In my description, I have codes for a couple of courses you can go and play yourself. They're also in the middle of this video. Let me know what you think if you do end up playing. Star Wars The Force Unleashed. One to two players, 3.4 gigabytes, an action slash adventure kind of game. I mean, it's Star Wars. You play as a player who is forced to join the dark side as Darth Vader himself finds you and turns you into his apprentice. A secret apprentice, not even the Emperor knows about. I can't 100% speak for other Star Wars games that have also been released this year on the Switch, but this one has ran just fine for me. And also, dual mode. You can use all kinds of Jedi and Sith to duel your friends or online and it is a lot of fun. Just the duel mode itself is a lot of fun. Don't starve. One player, 
1.5 gigabytes. Don't Starve Hamlet is also on sale for $5.29. It's a survival game that I absolutely love. You play as Wilson, who has been trapped by a demon. You can play on all kinds of different types of game styles for Don't Starve that you may want to play. Example, Shipwrecked or Reign of Giants are completely different modes. And can play as different characters that all have their own special traits about them. If you like survival, crafting, that kind of thing, you're going to love this game. I could almost guarantee it. Side note, my favorite character is Willow. You may or may not see why when you unlock Willow. Well that's it for my list guys. Keep in mind that there are plenty of other great games in the eShop right now. And most of them do end on June 6th, but you can find some that are going on for longer than that. Stay tuned for some more. Until next time guys, that's it for me. Have a great day.